perfect paradise for love. In this little rosy rendezvous, since you have said I do, the roses red are turning blue. Every day when you're away, all the little red roses get the blue for you.
Oh, good morning, Miss Lloyd. Good morning. Lois, this is Mr. O'Keefe. He's responsible for George's success in the ring. Well, not entirely. George does the fighting. I'm only his manager. But he's more than a prize fighter. He's a fine boy. That's right. He's only fighting to get enough money to go through college. To learn more about fighting? <laughs> Maybe so. When I started to manage him three years ago, I had dreams of just cleaning up with a good fighter. Now, I couldn't think more of him as my own son. You see, George is a scientific boxer. He never tried to knock out any of his opponents. Oh, but he could if I'd let him go. But to knock an opponent out, he'd have to take the risk of being hit. And while I'm his manager, I'm going to see that he takes as little punishment as possible. I'm saving that ahead of his for better things than a punching bag. Most of the old-time prize fighters are cutting out paper dolls. A prize fighter cutting out paper dolls. My, what a jolly pastime. Say, have you ever seen a real fight? Not since I left my husband. What? Come on, dear. Now, folks, I'll show you my famous left hook to the kidney. This is a punch that flattened more guys than Sunday traffic. Observe. <laughs> oh, boy, can I take him there? Can I, can I, folks? Ah, ah, pull him up, pull him up. That's a, look at that, folks, look at that. That's feet work. He'll call for help in a minute. Boy. Oh, well, have it your way, then. Oh, George, I've got something for you. What is it? A little something from me to you. Oh, Noreen, Miss Lloyd. I, I don't know what to say. I've never had a robe as nice as this one. It's beautiful. Oh, I'm glad you like it. And I hope it'll bring you good luck when you wear it tomorrow night in the ring. Oh, George, I want you and your entire camp to come over to a little party I'm giving this evening. I've invited a lot of people from the old baby company. You know, the musical show playing in Tonight? town. Tonight? Mm-hmm. Sure. That is a... Uh, how about it, Pop? Fine. I think it'd be a good relaxation for you, but you can't stay late. Oh, you're a darling. I promise to wrap them up and ship them home at 10 sharp. Say, I just remembered... We've got two girls coming down today. Could I bring them along? But I've invited plenty of girls. I know, but one of these girls is a friend of mine, and the other one goes with Ging, my table mate. All right, bring them along. Well, I have to be getting home now. I wonder where the other girls are. See you tonight. Now, listen, Pop. Why didn't you want to hear while I was in training? Well, I'll tell you, George. Sue knows too much about fighting and likes to tell you what she knows. But doesn't she come by eat naturally? Wasn't her father one of the best fight managers in the business? Yep. Tim Burke was a great manager. <laughs> Laying down again, huh? Say, why don't you go away? Can a fella take a little siesta? What are you trading for, a fight or a prize hog exhibit at a country fair? You're the kind of a guy that hates flowers and kitties. You're the kind of a guy that would slap a sunburned man on the back. What do you mean by laying, taking a nap in the daytime? Hmm, it's a habit I formed when I was a baby. You formed a lot of habits when you were a baby, didn't you? Yeah, but eating and sleeping is the only ones I'm still stuck on. <laughs> Yeah? Yeah. Besides, you should be encouraging me instead of saying things to break down my morality. What do you want me to do, kiss you? No, no, not that. That wouldn't encourage me. That would nauseate me. (laughs) Say, that mug you're fighting at the preliminary tomorrow night ain't going to encourage you either. No? I heard that Kid Fracas is training hard. He's in the pink. Yeah? Well, I'm on the red. But wait till I get my couple of these and a couple of the old Mary (laughs) Ann's. His pink will be black and blue. Going to mop up with him, eh? I'll make him look like a third raider. He's a third raider now. All right, then I'll make him look like a fourth raider. Go ahead, make me out a liar for a couple of rates. <laughs> 